Hi everyone, and welcome to First 20 here on Steven Plays. My name is Steven George, I play video games every Friday. It's the first 20 minutes or so of a game. Today, uh, that game is Songs for a Hero Definitive Edition. This is a game that came out two years ago on PC, uh, less than a year ago on Switch. It's on uh, PC, Linux, and Switch. And uh, Jam sent this in. It looked interesting because it's a, it's a platformer, but the twist is that it has a dynamic soundtrack with like funny lyrics that describe what you're actively doing in the game. And I was like, I'm down for that. I'm, I'm, I'm in, I'm in. I, I, I wanna see how that plays out. So uh, let's get started and see, uh, see what this is like. So we'll start a new file. Does the hero have a wardrobe full of armors just like that? I know you can hear me. I'm trapped. You've got to help me. The clock is ticking. I can feel it. You're the only one who can help me. A terrible villain has imprisoned me. Even the castle. This evil spirit. This demon. Only a true hero. Could it be possible? I believe it is, but please be careful. This will be dangerous. But you, you are my only hope. You can put an end to this darkness. What? What is that? It's okay. I had a bad dream. Let me walk outside. Sleeping with my armor on was really for the best. I won't have to waste my time. I'm ready for this quest. This is gonna be something. We are we are a bard. We are a bard. Are you are you ready? Are you ready for 20 minutes of this? If there was a queen, there might be a king. Find the secret portal. I will I will not be able to greenish hill. Greenish hill zone. I'll introduce myself. I'm the hero of this song. I have to save the princess and I just can't take too long. In order to find a castle, I know the recipe. Heading to the right is the only possibility. <laughs> I see a cliff up high, but that won't stop me at all. For I can do 12 foot jumps and I don't get hurt when I fall. Looks like an easy journey, there's nothing to give me a scare. Oh, never mind, I jinxed it, there's somebody over there. I have seen this tree before, or maybe I'm going insane. They look as if they're made from a mole, they all just look the same. I see a couple of snakes, but it's not too much for me. I just don't think that's fair, maybe I should check with the referee. I had enough of these serpents, they're always on the attack. Especially as a group, they might just sneak behind my back. Oh, there will be a few moments when I will have to duck. That will not protect me, so I shouldn't push my luck. There are so many serpents, they seem to crawl out of the earth. Although I had it coming because I am the one on their turf. I can see a statue on the other side of this tunnel. This could be a trap, there's no room for me to fumble. It just fired an arrow, but how it could isn't clear. I never knew a snake could be such a crafty engineer. Keep my head in the moment and take it day by day. With the quest so daunting, that must be the only way. Other than showing the way, there's no information to find. It is beyond my powers to look behind the sign. I'm always glad when someone says my sword does look nice. But it's a family heirloom, I won't sell it at any price. So like, I, I, I paused here because I'm like, I know that the words have to be... I have a bevy of talents, and that is plain to see. But the act of walking sometimes <laughs> is not my cup of tea. <laughs> like, I know that they have to be tied to the location where you are, right? Like, it has to be where you are in space. 
And that's why I stopped, because I was like, I want to see this, you know, stop. I see so many snakes, and the reason seems obscure. Am I supposed to hit them? Because I'm not even sure. Once I was told by a wise man, a fighter strength is a chin. How much of a beating you're able to take is what determines who wins. So, I mean, it, it very much is responding to what's going on, because not only is it map-based, but it's like action-based. Like, I got hit, so then there was a verse about getting hit. It's actually really clever. And it, it definitely appeals I'm a mighty water, to, but no matter to, how to myself. I try, whenever I touch a snake, I feel I am going to die. I'll jump over this chasm that's right in front of me. But I'm at zero altitude, how could this possibly be? I will be victorious, I do have what it takes. I can go on with this for days without any bathroom breaks. Oh now, bow gentlemen, could you please help me? I need to find a castle and set the princess free. <laughs> your voice is weird, doesn't sound like you're speaking. But for some reason I can understand the meaning. This conversation was nice. And you seem pretty alright But I must be going, got to get back to the fight Something is further along and it's hard not to stare What do I see? A piece of the ground is floating in the air Could I be losing my sanity? Or does this truly defy the laws of gravity? One thing about doing a first 20 on this game is that, um... I don't have to say much. <laughs> it does it for me. It's kind of funny. Right, there we go. Careful. Oh God, the snake. I have a spot. As if oh. there weren't enough, something else comes to sight. Another floating platform, but this one goes left and right. In spite of all the hardship, I will continue to strive. I'll do what it takes so the princess does get out alive. My heart is the power that's pulling me to the right. I trust in it to guide me until the ultimate fight. I am still confounded by all these floating floors. All I know is I won't stare into the abyss anymore. This game is a lot. <laughs> it's definitely a lot. Get down, little snake. Oh, crap. I carefully move. My effort will not be in vain. I have to take my time if I don't want to do this again. If these arrows hit me, I won't be happy at all. I need my wits about me. This challenge isn't so small. I see coins flying around and never hitting the floor. I'm willing to bet the flying coins must be worth much more. Something's always driving me to move to the right. So I will make the jump even though the bottom is out of sight. I defeated the snake and something strange came out. This whole thing brings new meaning to pouring one's heart out. Man. <laughs> there were apparently notes and chests in there. I did not find them. I, uh, I did not find them. These are the planes, but everything about this place is anything but. Sure. Sure. Not so greenish hills, oh, in Act 2. I'm a little confused now, can tell the truth from a lie. Everything just changed when I blink my eyes. 
As I go on with my journey, I notice something strange. I didn't expect the colors of the sky to suddenly change. I see another rival that dares to block my path. It has a serpent's body and a dragon's breath. With keen observation, I now have found a clue. It seems the enemies get stronger when they change their hue. I have to climb now, which puts me in a tizzy. I just hope and pray the hide will make me dizzy. Creatures are leaving the assortment of items in their wake. How weird is the diet of these snakes? I am fully aware that my quest has just begun. I wish I could be faster, but I don't know how to run. Wow. What a contraption, and it's so satisfying. You just jump on top of it, and then it sends you flying. Facing all these trials, I still know where to go. However, I must say that spring is giving me vertigo. The sun is burning me, I wish this would be over. There's but so much it's just a beginning, about. there's a lot of ground to cover. Oh, he stopped. He stopped. There's so many words. I'm going inside this cave and I'm ready to fight. I won't back down no matter what it is I find. How this spring works, I have already deduced. I just jump on top of it and then it gives me a boost. And like the meter changed too. Come on, little bud. Like, I, re I, th I thought whenever I, when I was reading about this game, I was like, oh, okay, I, I get the concept, but I thought that there'd be more, like, Even dead with time. Even the struggle that the journey entails, I remember the good will always prevail. I went through the left and I don't care if that is right, but I have found an item which might help me fight. I see blocks of flying, it's no longer news to me. It's just disrespectful to gravity. Baby, it's time to party, I'm having a good time. I'm just saying random stuff because I love to rhyme. What is up with the signs? Now this is such a shame. They're anything but helpful, they all just look the same. This fireball might be useful in my quest. I wonder how it didn't burn the chance. And since it didn't burn me as well I'm gonna use it on the snakes and raise some hell Oh, so that's maybe what the chests are. Chests are like additional spells. Neat! This fireball will help me clear the way I just need to charge it to fire away this is quite a puzzle, but it's not too hard for me. I suspect this furnace is the key. I'm a clever fellow, the solution has been found. But still, I don't know how the fire can make the bridge come down. Sometimes I want to stop and take a short time out. Whenever I run out of things to sing about. The enemy is far from me, but let him skip I will not. I'm gonna set it on fire with this new power I've got. I can defeat the enemy with a fireball. If I come across some more, I'll send or rain them all. I'm getting tired of fighting all these nasty snakes, but then I think it could be worse and then my poor honey. Rescuing the princess is something I must do. Someone has to save her, if not I, then who? I'm so glad the puzzle is finally out of the way. The fire that burns inside of me is here to stay. Snakes in my way won't cut any slack. Even when I'm jumping, I must attack. I have learned a lesson, my victory surely will. Depend as much on courage as on acrobatic skill. Again, there are so many words. I am blown away that there are this many words. I'm a master swordsman. I am very skilled. When the princess sees me, I am certain she'll be thrilled. So glad I don't see those bottomless pits anymore. Just thinking of falling down shakes me to the core. 
through the hottest days and through the coldest nights. I'll see hardship, but I know I won't give up the fight. Oh, I found the secret. Sing about the secret. Do it. Sing about the secret. Sing about the secret. I found something secret. You have to do it. I see another furnace, but now I have figured it out. I'll just use my fireball and see what's about to go down. Nothing actually happened. I am feeling a bit nervous. Yep. Someone should replace this broken furnace. I understand it now. I think I got it right. There's more than just one furnace that I'm supposed to ignite. Okay, careful. Here! This I wasn't expecting. I am a little confused. Nothing happened. I will need to find more clues. There sure are a lot of these things. Okay, well we gotta we gotta bridge down. I think we did it. We did it. The bridges come down now, for I am going to pass, and nothing here can stop me. I'm the best. Bridges that are drawn, or snakes that are on fire. None of it's enough to make me give up or retire. Look at this now, after beating many foes, I've made a lot of ground, and the castle's really close. With my trusty sword in hand, I am doing my best. And I will set the princess free at last! Man, is there a pause menu? I... I've arrived in the castle and I am confident that I can rescue the princess from her predicament. I look at the sky and I wonder how it might become noon again. I think we just skip the night. Now I see a bridge, there's a changing scenery. I have a feeling now that I am closer to the enemy. I can tell this is a very big castle. Finding the princess might be a bit of a hassle. I'm really curious. Oh, I guess you can't sing when you're dead. I was like, I wonder what the song will be when I'm dead. And then it's like, wait, he's singing. So there's no song, he's dead. I was a little disappointed. I was like, why ain't he singing? You can't sing with you. I'm gonna stop there. I'm gonna I'm gonna stop there and I'm gonna pause it because I I he will he will never stop. Uh Jam, thank you for sending this game my way. This is clever. This is really clever. It kind of makes me wonder how this hasn't been done before. Certainly it must have been done in some capacity in some way before. But it's you know, the game itself is 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 fine and the humor behind it is very funny. Um, they play into a lot of the different tropes of, uh, of video games and of platforming games and they sing about them and it's, it's clever, you know, for what, for what it is. Um, yeah. Yeah, Stanley, yeah, it's got, yeah, I guess it does have, uh, definitely a Stanley Parable vibes. It's the closest thing that I would, I would compare it to, right? Because it, that's a very similar concept. But this is, um, you know, done in a different way. It's it's cute. 
it's cute. I liked it. This is available on Windows, Linux, and Switch. And I will end it there. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next week for more First 20.